Hi guys, today I'm here doing a quick video on how to connect your Garmin GDL to your Garmin Pilot app. I had a couple issues when I connected mine and so I figured I'd do a quick video and clarify a couple things. As you can see I got my uh, GDL working, I got a couple traffic targets on the screen right now. So to start, first turn on your Garmin GDL. When it first turns on it will go into pairing mode. Once that's on, go to your settings, Bluetooth, then select the Garmin GDL, whatever model you have, to get that device paired. You can also pair a second device to your tablet if you wanted to, like I got my Bose A20 connected. So that looks good. After that's done, open up the Garmin Pilot. Click on the top corner. Go down to Connects, and mine's already connected of course, but when you first come in, you'll click on Devices down here and select which device you have. And the part that hung me up was this blue button here. You need to click on that blue button and then select the Garmin GDL that you're using. Once you do that, it'll connect and you'll get the blue light on the Garmin. So this screen shows a little bit of information for your GDL battery power, firmware installed. You can also do the reset of the attitude sensor. Feel other information here. So once that's done, you want to go to your map. And layers. And from here, the overlays, you can select FISB radar, FISB lightning, select traffic, of course. And then you can click on this bottom arrow. I'm going to bring up the split screen. I got traffic shown here. So I got two targets right now. And you can click on the target if you want, and it gives you information tail number, bearing, speed, and if it's climbing or descending and what rate. So that's pretty cool. Another neat feature is the AHRS attitude and heading. So I can click on panel. There's my panel. If I take the Garmin and just tilt it or roll it, you can see the pitch and roll change. So that's a nice feature to have. I also have it added up in the top bar here too. So that's about it. That should get you going. And thanks for watching.